I spent $455 in solo ads, and here is what happened. What's up, folks? Isaiah Jackson here of IsaiahJackson.com. And like I said in the intro, I spent $455 in solo ads, and here's what happened. So I'm going to go ahead and just dive into my ClickMagic account here. This is pretty much where I, what I use and what everybody should be using to track everything they do as far as getting traffic, especially when it comes to solo ads. And as we can see here, I bought $455 worth of traffic from one solo ad provider. Um, I have others as well, but I just want to show you this one solo ad provider to, to iterate a point, actually. So the first point being, not every solo ad is going to be profitable, <laughs> okay? As if you guess, it's pretty apparent. I mean, the solo ad I bought on the 7th of July, you know, that's a negative 8 ROI. I made most of that money back. Not all of it, but most of it. The solo ad I bought on the 12th, I made all of the money back plus more. And then the solo ad on the 17th, I didn't make any money from that. And at least I'll have to check my stats to double check it. But the solo ads are going to be profitable. However, all it really takes is one of them to be incredibly profitable for you to make all of the money you spend on advertising right back, which was the case with this. As we can see here, I got 1,457 unique visitors to my opt-in page. Okay, from that, I got 612 brand new subscribers, which puts me at a 42% opt-in rate overall. And from here, we can see I made 73 sales all right, from the amount of clicks that I got, which is where that 5% is coming from, by the way. In case you guys wanted to know how the sales are actually being calculated, I believe it's, last I checked, it was you take the amount of clicks you got and the amount of sales you got, and that would actually determine your sales conversion, sale conversion rate, really. Okay, so if I were to just pull out my calculator here and go 73 divided by 14.57 times 100, it's 5%, okay. But not all 1,457 people actually saw the page. It was only the 612 new opt-ins that saw the page. If we take that number into account here, we see here, we got 73 divided by 612. We actually converted at 11.9% on the sales page, which is incredibly high, especially with solo ads, okay? 73 new customers. Not bad. My cost per click, 31 cent. Not bad. Cost per acquisition, 73 cent or 74 cent, I should say. Not bad. Okay. CPS, my cost per sale, $5.99. My EPC, 45 cent. And of course, my ROI being 43% over the course of three so these three solo ads. Okay. So. <clears throat> The big, the first question to, to ask is how much did I make per subscriber? Okay, so we know if our cost per ac action here is 74 cent, in order for this ad to be profitable, I would need to make back at least 74 cent per each new subscriber that was added to my email list. So if I hover over this little icon here, we see I made $652 in revenue. It cost me $455 with a net profit of $197. Okay, now, if I were to do the math on that, I'm assuming I'm gonna get this right. So we made 652 and we got 612 subscribers, which means I made a dollar and six cent for every new subscriber that was added to my email list, as you can see right here. <clears throat> okay. And I only spent 74 cent per subscriber. That's a pretty damn good campaign, all right? In other words, it basically tells me to just continue running this particular solo ad campaign, bleed it dry. All right. Um, but like I said, this just reiterates that point that not all solo ads are going to actually convert for you as far as into sales. But the key here is, though, I have 612 subscribers. OK, 73 of which bought what I had to offer. The rest of them didn't. So I can still send them emails every single day, convincing them to buy what I have to offer. OK, in fact, that's 539 subscribers I didn't buy what I had to offer. So I can actually send emails to them until they actually buy what I have to offer or until they unsubscribe. All right. So I start just this quick video for you to actually show you what can actually happen if you stick with it. Okay. As we can see, the first campaign, negative eight 
okay, cool, whatever. The second campaign worked like gangbusters. Then the third campaign, nothing happened. That's completely fine with me. I'm completely cool with that. All right, so that's pretty much it for this video. Um, again, if you want to learn how to double the size of your email list in 30 days or less, simply hop on over to IsaiahJackson.com. Download the Double Your List Report. It reveals how you can actually go about doing that. Other than that, my name is Isaiah Jackson, and I look forward to talking to you guys soon. Peace.